Welcome, it's finally time, new stuff from Lona Shore. Uh, at this point in time, there is no band that has me more excited for new music than Lona Shore. Uh, the last EP was just unbelievable. Uh, I still consider uh, the title track and the Return to Nothingness my number one favorite song right now. Um, even after all of these months uh, since it released. I don't think there is any other song that I listened to more since it came out. Um, of the Abyss, also a phenomenal track that I still listen to a lot. Uh, to the Hellfire, of course, also great. Uh, my only problem with To the Hellfire is when listening to that song casually, like in my car for example, it's just impossible to listen to that final big squeal ending while keeping a straight face, you know what I mean? I just can't listen to it without laughing or smiling or making a nasty face. But don't get me wrong, uh, still an amazing track. Uh, yeah, I don't really want to keep talking. I'm sure you don't want to hear more talking, so Sun Eater, let's go. I'm so ready. a nice orchestra that we are kind of used to from Lord of Shore by now. You already know this is going to be so epic. Of course, blast beats for days. How can, how can something be so heavy yet so beautiful? Of course, his focus are insane. I wasn't ready. I'm afraid to talk because I'm afraid something crazy is gonna happen but I wanted to say his focus are insane but everyone already knows it so I don't feel like I have to mention that oh.
I'm having. That's so... Those drums though, that sounds pretty interesting. Sounds so big. What do I have to say, man? <laughs> I mean, it's so crazy, man. The thing is, it's Lorna Shore, so you're expecting stuff like that. Jesus. Those symphonies are, are such a huge element of, of their style, man. It just makes it sound so epic. Ah. All right. What a ride. Uh, there is a reason I was so excited for new Lorna Shore. Uh, I mean, I was hyped for new stuff ever since their last EP came out. I mean, do I seriously have to review this? Uh, best band on the planet let's start from there I mean I'm not even ex exaggerating I'm not someone who really overreacts to things or overhypes things I'm always honest I try to be honest I mean I challenge you to find me a band that would impress me even more than Lona Shore I don't think it's possible I mean everything about it uh, I mean, let's start arguably the best deathcore vocalist there is uh, insane drums the guitar, especially the the solo, man. I mean, if that doesn't give you goosebumps, or if you can't appreciate that, I mean, you should probably stop listening to music altogether. Uh, I mean, and then there's the like symphonic, the symphonic orchestra uh, stuff in the background, which just brings it all together in such an epic masterpiece. I don't know what they're going to do with this song. Uh, like, is there going to be an album or an EP? Uh, I don't know, I don't think they announced anything like that, um, but it doesn't really matter to me. I mean, this song is going to have me satisfied for a while. Uh, yeah, holy crap. Uh, I don't think I have. I really have anything else to say. Uh, I'm probably going to listen to this song again a bunch of times after I uploaded this video. Thank you so much for watching. If you have suggestions for me for songs to react to, for example, if you think there are bands that might impress me even more than Lorna Shore, uh, I don't think it's possible, but if you have an idea, please let me know in the comments, and I hope to see you on my next video.